Yes. <laughs> Whether he's making coffee or helping patients navigate hallways on the short stay surgery wing. Down the hallway to the right. 16 year old James Clements is finding there's not much downtime as a student volunteer at the North Mississippi Medical Center. I will take patients back and tell them, try to keep them calm during the process and just do anything I can do to make their day better. That skill will come in handy later on for James, who wants to be a doctor. He is one of 56 high school age students in the program this summer. Volunteer coordinator Carla Enos tries to match students with their interests. And this gives them an idea. Uh, sometimes if, if, you know, they think they want to be a nurse and so we put them on a nursing floor and they get, you know, some up close and personal experience and maybe helps make their mind up. In my room, this is Dasha. Can I help you? 16-year-old Dasha Shumpert is the first student volunteer allowed to work in the emergency room. It's real life. I get to see everything that happens in here. Dasha is a veteran volunteer. This is her second year in the program, and the IAHS junior says the experience gives her a perspective on the medical field that can't be found in textbooks. I don't want to go into a career not knowing what to expect and how to handle situations and what to do. So I just wanted to get my feet and hands wet and just get the feel of it. This summer, student volunteers will contribute more than 2,000 hours to the hospital system. It's a win-win situation for the hospital, a chance to have young, dependable volunteers, and for the students, an opportunity for a community service that also looks great on a resume. In Tupelo, I'm Allie Martin, WCBI News.